What's up everybody, Benji Bruce here, Speaking Lifestyle. I'm gonna show you how to build a bomb ass speaker website in one week. So you wanna update your website or you just wanna build a new speaker website, but how do you build a bomb ass speaker website when you don't know nothing about websites? So a lot of speakers make this harder, they make it more complicated than what it actually is. Building a great speaker website is, it's actually pretty easy, especially nowadays. So step number one, you simply buy a WordPress theme. And I always recommend WordPress, but you can buy whatever theme, as long as the theme looks good. Now here's the thing, your theme is very similar to a car. The better your theme is, the less work you have to do. So if you buy a 1980 car and you try to fix that thing up, you have to put in a lot of work. Like you, you gotta do a lot of stuff to make it look pretty good. On the other hand, if you just buy a Lamborghini to begin with, a Mercedes to begin with, a, a Bentley to begin with, a Rolls Royce to begin with, then you don't really have to do a lot of work. The work has already been done for you. So that's why you buy a theme to begin with. Now here's the thing, the theme, you buy the theme, most of the times, the, the theme already comes with pre-made layouts. So all you do is you, you simply take one of these pre-made layouts, you look through the pre-made layout, say, all right, that one looks nice, you pick it. You just say, bam, you load that pre-made layout. Now these pre-made layouts, they're done by professional web designers. So you already know they're, they're probably pretty good. So you just load one of those layouts, and then at this point, you just count the number of pictures on that layout. You say, okay, there's the header, there's this picture that they put on the right side. When I scroll down, there's this picture on the left side, there's this picture. You count how many pictures that is, whether it's five, six, 10, 20, however many pictures they have on there, you count that that many pictures. Now you know how many pictures you need to create for that website. So you are not gonna change the layout because remember, the, this layout was made by professional web designers. You're not gonna change a layout. All you're doing is just putting your stuff in there. Like that's all you're doing. So you say, let's say you know you need uh, 14 pictures. 14 pictures, three videos. You know you need all that for, for the homepage. At that point, you just take pictures. Like now you're just posing. have the pictures edited, you, you make sure that the, the edited comes from maybe a graphic designer who can just design some really cool images for your website. At that point, it just comes down to, to, to literally just filling in the website with your own stuff, the pictures, the images, the text. And remember, your website nowadays, most of it comes down to the images. Even the, the videos on your site, there's the thumbnail image that they see before they click on the video. So the better your images are on the site, the better your website is going to be. Also remember that most of it is, is on the phone. So remember that if you're reaching out to events, they're reading your email, they're reading your email on their phone and so they're going to click on the link to the website on their phone and then your website is going to open up on their phone. So you gotta remember that your website has to look really good on phones, on mobile. And, and so that's why most of it comes down to images because remember on mobile, everything is just like, it's all vertical, like picture, then text, then picture, then text. It's all the same. So there's no like amazing looking designs or anything. That's why the better your pictures, the better your entire website is gonna be. So that's why you really wanna focus on taking those really cool looking pictures, getting a graphic designer to design those pictures. And that's all you do, literally that that's it. If this takes you longer than a week, it's because you're not doing anything. Like you have to actually do the work. You have to actually go buy the pre-made layout of, or buy the WordPress theme. They have pre-made layouts. You upload the, the layout. At that point, you say, how many images do I need? All right, bam, I need some 12 images. Let me go shoot those images, bam, do your poses and, and all that, do the poses. And then at that point, you're just inserting the pictures, you're inserting your videos, and you're inserting the text. That's all you do. Don't change it up unless you know what you're doing in terms of designing websites. And then voila, you got an amazing looking website.